Welcome to the video Vago Lighting Management KNX. I will show you in this video how to use a KNX push button in the application. At first, a view to the hardware. We have here the application controller. Here we will find also a DALI Multimaster module where the lamps are connected and a KNX TP1 module where the KNX power supply and the KNX push button is connected. You see here the small room, I called it laboratory, with two tunable white DALI lamps. Before we start with the application, I want to show you the ETS implementation because every KNX device has to be configured in the ETS. I have here an ETS 5 project. You can find here our Wago TP1 module and the push button. I will open the plugin of the TP1 module parameter. And the first step is to import the ZimXML file. Click here on File, Import ZimXML file and you will get this simple file you need uh, together with the application software from the Vago website. After the import, you will find here a lot of group objects. Please pay attention, you have here an array index from 1 to 60, the same numbers you will find later in the application. And I will use the first KNX channel and the second one. Let's take a look which group object I have selected. So you see error index 1. I will use this to dim a lamp, so I need a switch and dimming object. And for the second channel I need the scene object to call the scene. The configuration is completed and downloaded to the hardware so I can continue directly with my application. In the browser I type in my IP address of the application controller. Please use HTTPS. The HTTP port is deactivated for security reasons. At first I have to log in with my username admin and the password Wago. And the application starts in the view function. But I want to start with my inputs. Inputs, KNX buttons. Here you see the numbers, the error index like you have seen in the ADS. So the first one I want to dim, use to dim a lamp. So I select the right virtual room, laboratory. For the second one the same, laboratory. The button type for the first channel, button up down, is correct, so can be used for dimming. But the second one I want to use to call a scene, so I change the button type to scene. Let's take a look to the outputs. Here we have our two tunable white lamps. I have addressed these lamps before by clicking on start and typed in the name. Now I want to assign these two lamps to the virtual room laboratory. I get the message I have to click on set groups, so I will do that. And in few seconds the settings are saved in the ECGs. And I want to configure also the scenes. So I select these two lamps again, click on configuration and can configure in DALI general the yeah, the brightness value for the first and the second scene. So I will configure 25% and 75% as a dim value. Okay, now I change to the view function and you see the laboratory has a function switching that is a standard function and I change this function to dimming. Now I can use my KNX push button to switch on and dim the lamp. So the short press switch on the lamp a long press on off, for example, will dim down the lamp and a long press on switch on will dim up the lamp and a short press switch off the lamp. Then we have configured also a scene. So uh, I want to call the scene at first with the second channel, scene 1, brightness value 25% and the second scene is 75%. You see the brightness value rise up. 